Hey everyone, Scott here from Simple Mechanic Advice. Today we are going to talk about how to fix the chassis control system fault on your Nissan. Here is what causes it and how to fix it. Battery issues. The electrical systems require an optimum power supply to function properly. A loose battery connection may contribute to the malfunction of the chassis control system. Additionally, car battery terminals may be covered with dirt or undergo corrosion over time, leading to malfunctions. Similarly, you may be dealing with a completely dead car battery. A dirty or dead battery may contribute to malfunctions in the chassis control system. To fix this issue, assess and replace damaged battery and connections by doing the following. Switch off the engine. Once the engine has cooled down, open the car hood to locate the battery in the engine compartment. Disconnect the negative battery terminal, followed by the positive terminal. Access the terminals for any damages. If you find any, consider replacing them with new ones. Remove the faulty battery from the tray. Use a wire brush or baking soda solution to remove corrosion from the connectors, battery terminals, and battery tray. Install the new battery. Reattach the clamps and secure the battery. Connect to the positive terminal first, followed by the negative terminal. Close the hood and test the battery. Sensor failure. The ABS sensor is key in the operations of the chassis control. The ABS sensor plays a critical role in monitoring the wheel's speed and rotation. This data is then shared with the chassis system for optimal operation. Over time, the sensors may be damaged due to mechanical wear or may be covered in dirt. A sensor failure won't provide reliable and accurate data to the chassis system, leading to an error. To fix this issue, replace your faulty sensor by following these steps. Use a jack to lift the car. Disconnect the negative battery terminal to avoid possible electrocution. Gently lower it to the jack stands and remove the wheels. Depending on your Nissan model, remove the brake pads and rotors to expose the sensors or access the ABS sensor near the wheel hub. Disconnect the sensor's electrical connectors. Check the sensor wiring and harness for damage. If you find any, replace them with new ones. Remove the faulty sensor and use sandpaper to clean its housing. Install the new sensor and reconnect the electrical connectors. Refit the brake pads and rotors. Refit the wheels and tighten the lug nuts, then remove the jack stands. Test drive and watch out for dashboard warning lights. Note that chassis control system errors can sometimes require professional diagnostic tools to clear the fault code after making repairs. Thanks for watching.